Hello everyone. In this video, we'll talk another type of discrete probability distribution, that is Poisson distribution. So let's start our discussion. Poisson probability distribution was named after a French mathematician, Simeon Poisson. It is this Distribution is particularly useful in problems that deal with finding the number of occurrence of a certain event over time or space, where space refers to area or region. We can say this event that happened over time or space is the main difference between binomial probability distribution and Poisson probability distribution. An experiment can be categorized to follow a Poisson process if it satisfies the following condition. The number of successes within a specified time or space interval equals any integer between 0 and infinity. The number of success counted in non-overlapping intervals are independent. And the third, the probability that success occurs in any interval is the same for all intervals of equal size and is proportional to the size of the interval. To understand further about the requirement of a Poisson distribution or a Poisson uh, random variable, let's see the example here. As a start, we will use the example of a Poisson random variable with respect to time. Here we have the number of customer that use a McDonald's drive through in a day. Let's see how this suit an event that follows a Poisson process. The first criteria say that number of success within a specified time or space interval equals any int integer between zero and infinity. We know that number of a customer that use a McDonald's drive through in a day is a result of a count which can be any number between zero or infinity. And the interval here is time, that is per day, or one day is equal to 24 hours. The second criteria is the number of success counted in non-overlapping interval are independent. This means that if we count in an interval of one hour and the next hour, the period or interval does not overlap. We define the interval of the period mutually exclusive. The last says that the probability that success occurs in any interval is the same for all intervals of equal size and is proportional to the size of the interval. For instance, in one day, there are 100 customers using the drive through service. Then, in half day, there is half from 100 or 50 customer. In one hour, then there is 100 divided by 24 customer, which approaches to four. Now, what about Poisson random variable with respect to space? As an example is the number of leaks in a 10 kilometer stretch of a pipeline. From the first criteria, from this example, we are counting the number of leaks in every 10 kilometer of stretch pipeline. It can be 0, 5, 10, and so on, the result of a count. The interval is the space, the per distance of a pipe. Here, we use 10 kilometer equivalent to 10,000 meter. The intervals are not overlapping and independent. So if we count 10 kilometers, then the next 10 kilometer doesn't overlap with our first 10 kilometer. So if I draw a pipeline here, say this is the pipeline. So let's say this is the first 10 kilometer, the next 10 kilometer. These uh, each 10 kilometers are independent and not overlapping. Then the next requirement say that the probability 
success occurs in any interval is the same for all interval of equal size and is proportional to the size of the interval. So for example, if we if there is 20 leaks in 10 kilometer, then there is four leaks in two kilometer, two leaks per kilometer and or one leak per 500 meter. So it is equal and proportional.